Good morning children. Today we are going to see a very familiar topic in grammar, active voice and passive voice. You know that we can write a sentence with the object in two ways. One is by using active voice, another one using passive voice. Let us see active voice first. Active voice tells us what a person or thing does. That means the subject performs the action on the object. So subject, what it is doing is called active voice. So we are giving emphasis on subject, the person who is doing the action. For example, Anna painted the house. The teacher always answers the student's questions. Ali posted the video online. In these three sentences, we are giving importance to the subject, the doer of the action, or about what we are talking. In passive voice, it tells us what is done to someone or something. That means the subject is being acted upon. Otherwise, we can say, in other words, we are giving emphasis on what is done, what work is done. For example, <coughs> the house was painted by Anna. The house was painted by Anna. Here we are giving importance to, emphasis to painted. So the action was painted by Anna, by whom it was given last, last preference. The student's questions are always answered by the teacher. So it is answered. That is what we are giving importance to the action answered by the teacher. The video was posted online by Ali. <coughs> so the video was posted by posted. Uh, we are giving emphasis to posted. Oh, correct. So the structure of the sentence will be object first, then the action or verb and with the use of preposition by we are using the subject. <coughs> 